crafty ones this is Pam with Pam's paper place I just thought I'd show you what I've been working on and I also got an awesome package today which is a new journal to add to my collection so I'm excited about showing that too um, this isn't anywhere near done I don't even know if I'm gonna have the same cover here I'm not sure but anyway I just thought I'd show you that what I've been doing is just working on a gypsy type journal and I've got a lot of embellishing to do it's gonna be quite large but um, yeah so I just thought I'd show you that this is what I'm working on right now is it's going to be quite large it has five signatures and it's already pretty chunky quite chunky and i'm not near done but anyway that's what i'm working on and now let's get to the um <coughs> excuse me newest purchase and this is um, a journal from um turquoise dreaming from sherry and look looks like she sent me some extra things here look at this pretty yarn green yarn wow look at the cute photo that is so cute I love old photos like that she said this is a few samples of my vintage sheets for you to enjoy and they are wrapped in beautiful wallpaper I received from Maria Sherry oh look at the cute little sticker a couple little stickers here on this guest check well thank you Look at these really pretty vellum pieces here. And I've never seen such tiny little, look at this little, uh, tiny like little flash cards. Those are cute. And <clears throat> what are these clips? That's kind of cool, a little plastic one. And um, some more little pieces of ephemera. Love ephemera. Very cute. And these little vellum pieces. Thank you, Sherry. Those would be pretty in a collage. And then, oh yeah, look at this wallpaper. That is pretty. Look at that. That would be really pretty in a botanical or shabby chic journal. And a lot of it, too. Thank you. That's very pretty. Love it. Thank you. Oh, and look at the vintage sheets. Oh, wow. Thank you so much. I love vintage sheets. Oh, isn't that beautiful? Wow, that's a large piece, too. Thank you so much. I do have a couple sheets that I need to uh, use, or I've just never cut them up, but oh, wow. Look at that. That is so bright and beautiful. Thank you. And this piece here, even if you find pillowcases, you can um, <clears throat> use them. Look at that. That is beautiful for a shabby chic. Oh, look at those roses. We have another one. Thank you so much for sharing with me, Sherry. Oops, this one is really pretty, too. Look at that. Thank you, thank you. Beautiful. They all look pretty together, too, actually. Oops, I just knocked over my glue there. Isn't that nice? They're quite large pieces, too. Thank you very, very much. Oh, I love it. Excited about that. And then we have this journal. It's perfect in this box. I don't know how you um, find a, found a box to perfectly fit that. Um, and her uh, shop is turquoise dreaming uh, dot etsy dot com. And I will put the link in the description. So let's. Open the journal, and I will have another beautiful journal to add to my collection. And 
and I love bunnies, and it was a bunny one, and I bought it before I even finished watching the, the uh, whole video, because I just knew it was mine. <laughs> Aw, it's such a pretty uh, yarn color. And cute. Oh, look it. That's a pretty card, isn't it? It's like an embossed card. And here is her uh, Etsy. It's Cherie Brown, turqu turquoise dreaming at Etsy.com. And her YouTube is turquoise dreaming. And uh, there's the link. Very nice. Uh, she's very sweet. She says, Dear Pam, thank you so much for your order. I appreciate it. Thank you also for your friendship and support and encouragement. You helped me find my first design team. Enjoy and take care. Blessings, Cherie. Very cute. Thank you. All right. Let's go into the journal. so cute here it is little gray rabbit a golden teletale book and i have several teletale books i've started making journals and then i kind of felt the need to make a boho journal so you know you kind of just go with what mood you're in and this is three signatures look at this pretty uh um ribbon and then it has a little um Ribbon and lace there, and it says scatter sunshine on this right here. So cute with the little bunnies. And that's kind of tied on there. Or you can just let me go up here a little bit. Take it off. Little gray rabbit. Aren't they so cute? What do we have? Another little package of goodies. Okay, look at the cover. Aren't they cute? Little bunny. Two ducks there. Three signatures. And then she covered up the barcode there. A pretty fabric. A little gray rabbit. Let's see if I think I can put it right here. Cute illustration. There's the fabric. And the telltale are a little smaller than... Uh, the size of the books are, I think, not quite six and a half by not quite six. And it's got real cute little um, fruit paper and the yellow lace here. I got yellow laces here, different laces. So sweet. And you have a little tuck here and a cute little. Um, is it a tag or an envelope? Yeah, envelope. And um, it has a, a fabric bunny and a little bit of lace here and collaging. Yeah, and it's a little envelope. And isn't that cute? Uh huh. Look at the bunny. It's been cut out. Cute. It goes back in the pocket. And here you have another little cute bag. Put something in. Oh, and then she used these little tiny miniature um, flashcards there on that bag paper. Bridge score pad. This is pretty. Paper, or maybe it's wallpaper. And then you got a beautiful tuck here that's been all collaged. And look at the sweet tag. Dream big, lace. She backed it on some different papers. Very pretty. This is a real cute little tuck here. She fussy cut the um, bunny here. And they have music paper and then pretty uh, lace that you could tuck something here. And the other side that's been kind of coffee dyed or dyed. And you got some graph paper 
with some pretty yellow paper. Oh, and here's a little bunny. Well, he opens up. That's cute. So you could write here. Very cute. And then you have some children's writing. And then like a guest page. Oops, I must. Oh, look at this, like writing on the, on the back here. And then this is flipped up. And you have a real cute little uh, card there. And this is, um, looks like cross stitch or embroidery paper. And then there's a cute little green and pink button. And another little tuck, and it's a little vintage ad. And uh, like the back of like some ledger type paper. Very fun. Lined paper. And that's, oh, it's a, like a, a recipe page that's been written on. And then you have a little fabric here, and it's a little, or a rick rack, a little mushroom flip, and a pr pretty little postcard with some irises. Very pretty. And then you have a little lace on the side here. And more of that vintage, like fabric lace. There's an old Coke uh, advertisement, Coca-Cola, and coffee dyed paper, and there's, um, that's wrapping paper or wallpaper. And then here we have a little money and a little um, ephemera piece on here that can be flipped open from the other side of that bag, paper. And then here, we've got a pocket, a little more of that yellow crochet lace. And then here is a little um, booklet. Oh, look at she put the uh, play money here, and then you got some dyed tie dyed paper that you could write. That's cute with a Monopoly money. I like that. Very clever, Sherry. And that's the first signature. And then here you have some more lace here. Fun fruit paper, and here's the beginning of the book. It's 1979, looks like Little Gray Robert. Cute papers, and here's a vintage magazine, looks like. And another one of these little flashcards with a little flower here. A little story. And then here's like a recipe card that's in this plastic sleeve, so you could take that in or out. And then you have an Edith Holden page. An old, oh, like mag, uh, albums, page, music man, Jimmy Durante, Durante, and more of the cute story, and a little um, paper clip with fabric. And I have a tally card here. Hummingbirds. It's a cute little story, I'll have to read it. And then more like a little advertisement in pink. Carbonless paper there. And this is cute. It's like a little paper clip on here. Oh, and here's the second signature with a couple little buttons. And then this paper clips on. This is cute. I like the little twine along here. And she stamped and added a Velveteen Rabbit page or um, book page and a little the bunny she cut out and then it's like a little like a little wallet almost like a little wallet type thing with a fold out for that bridge paper that's cute I like that idea and then this is a pocket I like that great idea I love that to use that I'll clip it in later and the more of that um, form expense report and then there's two pages here well this story that's more of the Warner Brother records and there's an Edith Holden page pretty flowers and then this is another one of the recipe cards that can come out of the sleeve 
adorable book. Sweet. And the cute illustrations. Oh, and there's a little bunny that's been sewn on this like embroidery page. And that's the end of the second signature. Here's the third. And we have a little, this was cute, this little Peeps um, playing cards. That's cute. I like that idea too, Sheree, on this like tie-dye paper. Ah, uh, cute. Great idea. So I've got some great ideas here. Oh, that's cool with a little receipt and then the vintage uh, ledger, 1989. We have a little recipe page. It looks like some vintage type paper here. And she fussy cut the bunnies out and made a cute little um, card with flat back and a uh, little applique pieces. They're sweet. And this is cute. The flowers, really pretty illustrations. There's some really thin, thin, I've never seen graph paper that fine. It's almost like vellum. That's cute. And look at this little bunny. Um, she, I think these are eraser tops or something. I'm not sure where she got them, but that's so cute. And a ball pin. And just one of this uh, checklist like almost like a test page. Here's a Velveteen Rabbit page. And this is really cute um, embroidery image with a bunny. And this flips up. Look right here, a little flower. And then we have some nice writing paper, which is stamped. Cute little book. And this is, looks like another little book and it has a couple little um, buttons on here. Look rack added. On a card. This is a card here. No. Oh, this is the other side of a card. And a little pretty vintage uh, ribbon with lace on the edges. And here's this really fine thin little tuck here. A graph paper almost. There's a vellum feel to it. More of this really beautiful um, garden page. This is a cute little belly band she collaged. Cute little boy and drums and oranges. And look at the cute bunny. It's like a almost like a felt piece. So cute on this little uh, what do they call these little poster notes? That's cute. He's soft. Oh, <laughs> very cute belly band. Adorable. And a little recipe. A woman's workman's paint and paper. A ledger sheet. And we have a little play money here. That's made into a tuck with a flashcard and a cute little tag. It has a little uh, key, some fabric at the top. This came out of there too. More little places to journal. And then here's a tuck here. Maybe they came from here. And that is the end of the Golden Telltale Book, Little Gray Rabbit. And then um, she sent me some other little things that I can put and decorate into the journal. I could even add this bag in there too. We got more of the fabric, some tickets, this um, guest check paper. This almost looks like it's been dyed pink. Fun, more fun little Rolodex cards here. We have some little cutouts in the shapes of flowers. 
and more little pages, book pages, and a little bingo card that opens up, and some more papers that would go good in the book. A little folder, and then more paper, quite a bit more paper for, you know, if I wanted to add um, to the book. And then this, oh, look at little, oops, more little pieces, and a couple buttons, cutouts that you can use in the journal little buttons so that is my adorable little gray rabbit um, from Cherie turquoise dreaming I'll put the link uh, to her shop or her true YouTube channel oh there's a couple more things in here too I could reuse this little um, envelope too so I'll put a link to her um, YouTube and thank you such so much for watching I'm, I'm excited about my new addition to my journal I'm gonna go through it again now but thank you so much, Sheree. Uh, thanks for your friendship also. And I'm excited to add this journal to my collection. Y'all have a great day. Bye-bye.